everyone! So today I am doing the Winter Alicious tag. As of filming this video, no one has tagged me that I am aware of, but um, I tag all of you to do it. I will list all the question questions in the description box below. This was started by MacBarbie07, and I'm really excited because I actually watch her. A lot of times they'll say, this was started by so-and-so, and I have like, no idea who they are. I'm like, great. But MacBarbie07 I actually watched, and I remember when she uh, just did this video and put it out, and I thought it was so cute, and then I saw Daily Grace do it, and I was like, okay, I'm going to do it. I mean, sometimes tags can get repetitive and... I don't know. I wanted to do it anyway, so let's get into the questions. Um, one, favorite winter nail polish. Now, I know this is like, well, I guess this is sort of winter because it's glittery, but it's probably this Milani in just gold. Um, it is very, very gold. I mean, you could put two coats on this in your toes or your nails will be solid gold. Obviously, I used it on my toes because I have acrylics, but I think this is so, so beautiful, but be warned. It is thick and it is very very glittery and gold and it definitely like looks like you have a gold mine on your fingers but um, it is really really hard to get off so I use this kind of sparingly um, or like if I have a special occasion to go to or something like that but it is very very gold if you use one coat over a color it'll look really pretty as well so um, I love this I'm really bad with the nail polish ones because I don't buy a ton of nail polish because obviously I only use them on my toes so Two, favorite winter lip product. This was pretty easy to me because it is my go-to lip product. I keep it in my purse like all the time. Um, I have it on my lips today over CoverGirl Lip Perfection Divine. Um, and it's this, oh, I should probably show you guys the packaging. It's just this like baby lips. It comes in the teal with the pink. And it has this sort of berry color to it. Obviously, I have black gloves, so that's not a very good. Um, I don't know what this color is. Oh, grapevine. And my biggest thing in the winter is just keeping my lips moist, and I like that this has a pretty nice pigmentation to it, so I do have it over my lips now. And it does give it a sort of deep berry color, and um, it really moistens your lips. Like, it's almost like a gloss without having it sticky. Because it gets windy where I live, so it's like my hair is blowing everywhere, so I don't want to wear a lip gloss, but it does give it that nice sort of sheen, creamy lustrous lip look but I love baby lips it's made by Maybelline and it's super super cheap um and really really great so without a doubt one of my favorite or it is my favorite winter lip product um most worn winter clothing piece so okay so this was kind of because the next one is favorite winter accessory so I guess you could switch this I don't know if you would consider gloves an accessory or clothing piece or boots an accessory or clothing piece um but I am going to do my boots as my most worn winter clothing piece and they are these Ugg boots <laughs> which I love you guys have seen these in my November favorite um these are without a doubt I have three pairs of Ugg these are my favorite. These are the cable knit gray, and I just love these. They're very slouchy. They make your leg look really slim, and um, I actually posted a picture of my legs in them on Facebook and Instagram. If I can get it, I'll insert it. But they are super, super comfortable. They have that sort of cheap skin underneath, and they're actually pretty affordable for Uggs. I think they're only like 170 So then it goes to my most worn winter accessory. I swear this is not a plug, but I will just put a disclaimer that Trisha's Treasure Chest is my online store. Um, and there are these arm warmer gloves. I love these. I love that you can have your fingers and thumbs through them like so you can drive and my nails can stick out. Um, they are very, very warm, and they are perfect for keeping my hands nice and soft. What I do is I put lotion on right before I put my gloves on, and then I put them and it kind of like locks that moisture in and it feels so good so without a doubt it's these gloves um probably my black and my gray are most worn i do have a brown pair but i only wear those when i'm wearing brown obviously um favorite winter scent or candle so originally i would have said obviously november favorites i mentioned the christmas tree was my favorite scent but i'm gonna have to go with bath and body works Merry Cookie! Oh my gosh, wait, what does it say? Yeah, Merry Cookie. This is so good. It has a recipe for cookies. This smells like sugar cookies. Oh my gosh. This is like a sugar cookie cupcake. Like everything I love in this world. And it's like amazing. It's like when you go, have you guys ever had those black and white cookies? They kind of taste like a donut and they got them at like the really like posh bakeries. It's kind of what this smells like. And it makes me really, really hungry and I love it. And this is... Amazing. I just started burning it, but I'm, I'm sure this will be gone before the end of the month. It's without a doubt my favorite, favorite, favorite scent slash candle. Um, favorite winter beverage. This was also easy for me. If you would have asked me two weeks ago, I would have said hands down peppermint mocha from Starbucks, which I still love. But honestly, what I'd want even more and I crave even more than that is this 
uh, salted caramel hot cocoa by Starbucks, and it's for, you get it for your home, obviously. And when it comes to calories, I would much rather have this. And not only is it cheaper and less calories, but it's actually so tasty. They come in these little packets, and um, it, sh it shows you, like, all the directions how to make it. And obviously, if you want to make it for more people, you can put more. This is just so good. Like, originally, remember, guys, when I hauled this in my Target haul, I was like, I'm kind of unsure if I want you know, salted caramel hot cocoa. Like, I was kind of unsure. Salted caramel, I don't know. I do love things that are sweet, and I love things that are salty. So I was like, okay, let's try it. And hot cocoa is my favorite drink in the crisp, in like, during the winter time, just because it's so yummy and delicious. Um, so yeah, I pretty much make one of these every day. It's why I'm gaining weight. I know everybody's saying I've been looking so fat lately, and I'm sorry. It's just because I love holiday treats. I wish I was actually skinny, but I'm not. Oh, people. So hard sometimes to be on YouTube. Um, so that's my favorite winter beverage. All-time favorite Christmas slash holiday movie. Um, I mean, I don't know if I have a favorite Christmas slash holiday movie. I, I mean, I really like Home Alone. I like Home Alone 2 Lost in New York. It's, like, my favorite. Um, like, when it's on TV, like, I'll watch it. But it's not like I own it or anything. So I guess it's my favorite. I also like to watch Elf when it comes on. But, you know, it kind of gets played out. Um, and then when I was younger, it was a Christmas story because my dad really loves that movie. So... I just watch anything that's on, really. I'm not, like, too picky when it comes to that stuff. If, like, it's on TV, I'll watch it. Um, favorite Christmas slash holiday song? It's, that's pretty easy. It's Elvis Blue Christmas. I have it as my ringtone every year in December. Um, it's such a sad and sweet song. And Elvis's voice when he sings his Christmas hymns are kind of amazing. Well, hymns and songs. It's not Christmas hymn. But he does do some religious Christmas songs. And it's kind of, like, amazing. I love Christmas music. I love our Christmas music at church. Um... But definitely Elvis singing Blue Christmas is is beautiful. It kind of like makes me cry. Um, yeah. I love I love it. I love it so much. Um, favorite holiday food slash treat? Um, I don't have it to show you guys because I don't buy them from my house. Because if I bought them from my house, I would probably eat them all in one sitting. And it is the Winter Fudge Oreo Cookies. My mom has them at her house and they are so, so good. It's just an Oreo cookie with like the white fudge over it. Oh my god. We used to have those when I was like a kid too. They're without a doubt my favorite. I really want some, but like honestly guys, I would eat it all. You guys know I have like a compulsive problem. Like I have an addictive personality where I can't stop and I love it so much. I wish I had them here to show you, but I would eat them right after this video if I did. Um, what is your favorite Christmas decoration this year? Really easy. My pink tinsel tree. Um, I showed it in my Target haul, but I don't know if you guys have seen it up yet. So, uh, I will insert a clip of it here. But that tinsel tree is so beautiful. Everybody gives me compliments on it when they come over. It's like a little Barbie tree. It's 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 adorable. I love it so much. Um, what what's at the top of your Christmas list? Um, this is kind of hard because you know as you get older and be like an adult. I mean, you don't you kind of either buy everything for yourself or you just don't really want a lot of things anymore. I mean, most people will give you cash because. You're an adult, you need to pay bills and stuff like that. So I don't know if I have something like at the top of my Christmas list, um, like a physical thing, you know, like that you can actually touch. But um, I definitely, you know, always just want health and happiness for my family. Like every holiday that comes by that I'm with my, that I get to see my dad and I get to see my mom and my brothers and my sisters because they're still here with me on earth is a blessing. Like I don't, I don't want to think about the year that I have to go through the holidays without my family, you know, and I don't take it for granted. So I just, I always just want everyone's health and, you know, that's the main thing for me. And if I get to see them another year, then that's really all that matters. And I'm telling you, I know I'm like materialistic and I can be a little superficial in some people's eyes, but everything that I buy material wise is it's my money and you know I work for it and stuff like that it's not like I just you know want to take from people I'm more of a giving person when it comes to that stuff so I like to give presents and um you know it was really fun this year that I was able to get my mom a bed and my sister an iPad so I was able to get really cool gifts this year for people um and I gave them to them early so they can enjoy them all month long and I did get some little stuff but I'll keep that sh a surprise um <laughs> so maybe I'll vlog Christmas who knows we'll see Christmas is kind of exciting I think for our family. Um, and then finally, what are your plans for holiday, the holidays this year? Well, pretty much every year. I'm very fortunate that my family lives in Southern California. So basically I spend Christmas Eve and Christmas with my mom and my sister. And then I had down to my dad's on Christmas afternoon with my brother and his girlfriend. 
So that'll probably be it again. Um, like we usually play poker either on Christmas or um, the day after Christmas with my dad. And then we usually go see a movie. So it's pretty fun. And we eat a lot. My mom cooks. It's really fun. So I think we're having Christmas at my house this year with my mom. And then I'll be going out to my dad's in San Diego to spend Christmas with him. Okay, so that is it. That was the Winterlicious tag. Um, I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys will do this tag. It is a lot of fun. It's kind of fun. Like, I do think about some of these things, obviously, beforehand, so I can show you guys. Um, but it is fun, and it kind of gets you in the spirit. So, I know there's another one called the Holly Jolly tag, and if it's not too similar, maybe I'll do that one. Also, like up this video, if you guys want to see Christmas decorating on a budget, um, if you guys want to see what my whole area looks like decorated for Christmas. And I hope you guys have a very happy holiday season, whatever you celebrate. Um... Just have a really good happy year and be thankful for your family and everyone you could spend time with. Um, never take it for granted. And I don't, you know. So, um, anyways, I love you guys so much. And I'm really, really thankful for you guys. Thank you guys so much for sticking with me another year. And I hope to see you guys, you know, next holiday season doing this. This will be super fun. But I love you all so much. And uh, I have a holiday giveaway coming up for you guys to win. Just to show you guys how much I love you. Kisses for my fishies. Mwah! Happy holidays, guys.